Hey guys, welcome back. For today's video, I'm going to show you exactly how to achieve this nice festive New Year's Eve look using only one palette. So to begin the look, well, this is aside from the palette, the only other thing that I'm using, um, it is a base. So you can choose whatever base that you want. I love to go with my MAC Paint Pod bases. This is in the color uh, ochre, soft ochre. I was gonna say painterly, but this one is soft ochre. Just to give me a nice even canvas to work with. Next, with using the palette and just a large you know, shading brush, this is E60 from uh, Sigma. I'm just going in with the color Millennial and applying that onto my entire lid. Then going in with my Sigma E40 brush, which is just a nice big blending brush and the color Millennial once again. I'm applying that on to my lid and using that as a transition shade. So just building that color up so that it's a nice transition shade for me. Next, using the exact same brush and the, col the color Girls Night from the palette, I'm concentrating most of that color onto the outer corner or like the outer portion of my lid underneath the crease and also on the crease, of course, and dragging whatever's left of the product into the inner half of my crease and kind of like toward the corner of my eye, as you can see, and just windshield wiping and also like circular motions. So that's going to give you the best blending result. Then going in with double tap and of course the exact same brush again and doing just the exact same thing that I just previously did which is concentrating most of the product at the beginning on the outer corner of my eye or the outer half of my eye and then dragging whatever's left of the product into the inner half of my crease. Does that make sense? Next, going in with Sin City and a Sigma E25 brush, I am starting to build up the black. So black is really, really hard to work with. So I usually like to start off light and then just kind of build up the intensity as I go. That way I don't get too overwhelmed starting with like too intense of a black right away. So I'm applying that just like I did the previous two colors. So in windshield wiping motions and circular motions as well, and then just building that color back and forth, back and forth along the crease, and then dragging it a little bit up above the crease. And then using a Sigma E45 brush, which is this tapered blending brush, it's going to give me a more precise application right along the crease, which is what I want, because I really wanted to build up that color, mostly around the, along the crease. I just wanted everything else to look really smoked out and blended out but I wanted the crease to continue to still be pretty dark. So I did that. Then applying some glitter glue onto my lid where I'm going to want to place the glitter. This is just, I'm applying it with a concealer brush because I feel that it gives the most even and thin application. So I'm applying it exactly where I'm going to want to place the um, glitter that came along with the palette, which is the Glamour Dust, I guess, glitter. And this is in the color Nude Beam. Absolutely love it. I just didn't know what I would ever use it for. And then this came up and I was like, perfect. It's gorgeous, glamorous and I think it's perfect for the occasion. And I'm just using the exact same brush that I applied the glitter glue with. I'm using that in order to pack on the glitter and apply it onto my lid where I place the glitter glue. I wasn't gonna add a liner, but then I decided at the very last minute to do so just because I felt like that really made it nice and glam and just added that extra something that this look might need. So I decided to go in with Kat Von D's tattoo liner in the color Trooper. Going in with a more precise brush for my lower lash line, this is from Real Techniques. I am going to be building up the colors on there. So going in first with Girls Night and applying that onto the bottom lash line. Then on top of that, I'm gonna apply Double Tap and on top of that, I'm gonna apply Sin City. And then I'm gonna go in with a pencil brush and this is just from an Anastasia palette. Um, and just blend it out so that it doesn't leave me with any harsh lines underneath the eye. 
Then going in with NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in the color Black Bean and applying that onto my waterline, followed by some false lashes. These are from the House of Lashes in Iconic, which I thought were just pretty, pretty perfect for this look. And then of course finishing off the look with some mascara onto my bottom lashes and my top lashes in order to blend my natural lashes to my falsies. So that is it guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope that you enjoyed this video and that you give this look a shot this New Year's Eve. As always, take care and I will see you guys next Tuesday. Bye!